<laughs> I'm just thinking he would say, say why do they say that sashi? It probably means come in the room now. <laughs> He's this cute thing, he goes. <laughs> just say it in dog language. <laughs> okay, go. Cool. Uh, how are pickup warriors supposed to react <laughs> when in the garden of poison trees they encounter uh, fragrant flowers like a perfect house? And explain the two parts that they of their practice. You're supposed to be happy about it. Right? They're supposed to know know that they have the attitude that they're doing it for the benefit of all beings. That's one part. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. First part, uh huh. And second. What I said. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh. Because. Because they're doing it for the benefit of everyone. And they no, use it. Oh, use it as a point. Because. Desire. How they use. Desire is so dangerous. Uh huh. I'm not sure I understand the clarification. Uh huh. Oh, because it oh, they're not going to leave the house until they reach enlightenment, yeah. mm -hmm. or something like that. Because the Buddha did that at the Bodhi tree. Mm -hmm. Then, what do the five feathers on the peacock's oh. warrior's head <laughs> five hats. Oh. <laughs> represent? And what does this mean? Five paths. Yeah. And what does does what particularly in the five paths? Uh, the p path of accumulation, the path of preparation, the path of seeing. No. <laughs> it means that they achieve them one by one yeah. by using desire as a path. Oh, cool. Achieve what one by one? The paths. Yeah, the, path. the five paths. So, yes, yeah, so the five paths. No, but <laughs> I wasn't concentrating on the five paths. It's achieving anyway. Feather by feather. Yeah, one yeah. by one. <laughs> <laughs> so then the Bodhisattva Buddha. Uh, and then at the end of the, uh, where we finished last time, uh, what did uh, the Nishin Lord did Tsongkhapa said on this subject, and how can this serve us as a warning? He said he was he was so afraid of it. Yeah, scared. He was yeah. scared. To he didn't death like to sit on the throne, the fancy teaching throne. He was right. he was scared to death. Mm -hmm. What was the Tibetan word? Truck something. Oh, he was coming. So yeah. Oh, yeah, don't be doing hard. Oh, oh, you're so oh yeah, nice. Nice. Uh, THR O N E. THR. Yeah, yeah. Throne. What? Yeah. Oh. You can sit on a throne. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Tirado. And you said the three vocabularies? Vocabulary words? Oh, no. Have some fun. To do it with fun, right? Yeah. Cool. Well, I don't know if it literally means joyful effort, but I read yeah. do it with fun, so. Wow, that's yeah. a long one. Type of. Oh, are one and the same. Oh, from one. Oh, well, maybe. Oh, for no, you can look at it. An alternate way? Yeah. I have to ask Keshe Michael for clarification. Uh, I think it's that one. I don't know. Hang on. Um, Can I just say something about the joyful effort? Uh, Isn't joyful effort a different word? Yeah. 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 Oh, so you can be able to it's apply it is. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm saying you wouldn't be able to apply joyful effort to this word. If it, yeah, you're um, that's a question. I think you're right. I think that it's already, it's there's already another thing? Tibetan <laughs> phrase that we use for cool. that's all. Yeah. 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 Cool. By the way, uh, in modern Tibetan, they shorten it to tanglang, tanglang, and it means voluntarily. So does anybody want to go do this job, tanglang? You're not going to get paid. And then, so in, in modern times, it means willing to do it happily without getting paid. Okay, yeah. yeah. This one, I'm going to check too. Yeah, uh, that's nice. Yeah. yeah, that's nice. And the last one, and uh, check now. It's terrifying. Yeah. yeah, good, good. It doesn't mean scared and appear. It, together, <laughs> it's an idiom that means terrified. Yeah, nice. That's a good word.
Cool. You have the plane. All right. I got the plane. We go fame and find out where we are. Okay. Ba 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 ba. Uh, just to say where we were, Bernard, Tamji, Kimbe, Kyang, please, please don't talk if you can, unless it's desperately needed, okay? Bernard, uh, Narje, Tamji, Kimbe, Kyang, in days gone by, Jetson Kappa said, Ko ni shingi ti ten chamala dukso, when I sit down on the big thrones of other lamas, I get scared as if I were seeing my own, my chest open and my heart beating. Even, even if I see a video of a heart beating, it freaks me out. I, I, something about it, you know, so, ugh. Okay, so, Katsawatar, as he said, and now we continue with the image, okay? Uh, Nick? Shen dun de do yong de de yong so la long che Petsena Yang Rang de Tang Long Sem Sok me Sok me Sok me Parnang Tu Te Dat Tat Gi Nye Ni Nye Nye Mik Sok Kong Du Chu Pe Chu Ping Jing Tang Che Pe Gone Chiro Du Tu Not in English Shengi Sok Zok Parche Cha Cha Chiro Cho 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 Wei So Gi Dang Du Lang Not in English T Tang tu, tang tu, lang ku te. Right. Yeah, tang lang means take it up happily, do it happily. Dang lang means to get angry. S D A N G. So you cannot say the D, okay? You have to say dang. Dang. Yeah, tang and dang. Tang means voluntarily. Dang means angrily. Okay. So don't don't say D when it's not a D. Okay. That's like. Mozart and Mozart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you're amazing. You're, a, me, you're, you're an embarrassment. <laughs> I was like jumping around the room. V's like, what's going on? I said, I figured this goddamn thing out. <laughs> okay, anyway. The dog's like, the dog's just looking. Exactly. Like, I'm trying to sleep, man. <laughs> but he's always trying to sleep. <laughs> okay, anyway. <laughs> Shen Dun Tu, Du Yun Sok La Long Che, a very profound statement. See if you can break it. See if you can crack it. We should um, enjoy. We should, we should happily um, use what we have to benefit the goals of others. Yeah. Wendy. Long Che means enjoy the use of your beautiful home in DLC. For the sake of others. Do were you hear the last class? No. Oh, well, the last class, we were on the subject of how a bodhisattva <laughs> can get a beautiful house and it's a good deed. And, it, and their, their whole motivation is may I use this? Duyan means the uh, pleasures of the senses, right? Duyan is normally a bad word. You know, Duyan means attraction to taste, attraction to pastries, coffee things like that. And he's been on the subject of is it ethical to own a large beautiful house, okay? And uh, he said, uh, a body, if the Bodhisattva knows what they're doing, they can turn it into a cause for enlightenment, okay? So, Shen Dun Tu, Du Yun La Long Chu, enjoy the normally forbidden objects of the senses for the sake of others. It's a cool idea, you know, drive a nice car for the sake of others, live in a comfortable home for the sake of others, okay? The whole concept is, is uh, profound and dangerous, okay? It's like a, 
Riding a poison, <laughs> like a garden full of uh, poison ivy. The whole image here is peacocks walking to a, a garden full of poison ivy, because they eat it and it makes them beautiful. Okay, all right. Long chupetena. When you do that, yang rang de. Don't ever do it for yourself. For what you want. Okay. Don't do it for what you want. And don't do it with lom sem. Uh, we had it in his book. Yeah, delusions of grandeur. Yeah, lom. Yeah, lom means uh, I'm such a cool person. Okay. Yeah, delusions of grandeur specifically. Okay. Nyanjo right. par lom. Delusions of being a yogi. Hi yogi. Yeah, tantric vow. You you break a tantric vow. This one is similar. Lom sem. Don't think oh I'm so I'm so amazing. Okay. So <coughs> mepar, because then it will poison you. Okay, so mepar, without that, uh, nangdu, sorry, nangdu, yeah, in your heart, inside, inside, didak in yemik, so kongdu kongdu chu? Correct? No, kongdu chu means uh, grasp, oh, that's right. or figure out, okay, kongdu chu, totally idiom. Understand. You should, you should kongdu chu, their nemics. Uh, their faults. Yeah, the dangers of a nice house, okay? Nyemik means the dangers of a nice house, okay? You should understand. Always stay aware of the dangers of this, of this beauty and comfort you surrounded yourself with. Nyemik, in fact, I would go so far as to say jikpa. Be afraid of it. Yeah, have a healthy fear for luxury. Mm -hmm. uh, have a f healthy fear of comfort, mm -hmm. okay? Use it. Enjoy it, but always for others, okay? For the sake of others, all right? Chepe uh, Gone, and we were talking downstairs yesterday about how attaining comfort uh, could be done with the motivation of inspiring others to use the four steps. You see what I mean? Dang Chepe Gone, with doing that, with that, okay? With doing that, in that way, Gone, Chiroki Shengi Zol Sopar Jachir. On the outside, uh, other people can, outside of you. This is a weird, uh, this is difficult, okay? It's the idea that you will accept a donation to help the other person, okay? And it's dangerous, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let me help you, Nick. Just put the money in my. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dangerous, uh, but true. Possible, it's possible, okay. Uh, I don't need your donation, but I'll take it to, to help you. But that's, that's very dangerous. But we're on that subject. This is what this book is about. You know, desire is a path, okay. So chiro, do shenki zok, so others can collect good karma. Zok zok means collect good karma, right? Senam yeshi zok shin. Okay, we say it five times a day. Uh, so that others can make good karma. Chachir, troa. Dig into your new house. Enjoy. Troa means dig it. Enjoy it. Have fun. Okay? Good thing. Okay? But so that others can be helped. Okay? Dang de lang. Have that motivation. No. Oh, happily. Happily. Grab, yeah, grab yeah, yeah. that house. Grab it. Okay, yeah. grab it, yeah. get it, yeah. enjoy it. Okay, got it? Get there. Okay, get down, get down. <laughs> okay, go. De tar che na nye mi sampe wang ki de yon so ki ne par minu arma se te nu pe Nice prenasal. Nice. Very nice. Your Tibetan is getting better. Teta Chena, if you do it this way, okay? If you maintain an awareness of the potential dangers, 
uh, as you enjoy these objects of the senses, meaning in pleasant house, pleasant car, uh, nice clothes, people give you Chinese suits, <laughs> okay? As you use them, if you maintain this awareness of the potential dangers, Won't be able to hurt you. they will not be able to hurt you. Yeah, they will not have the power to hurt you. Masse. Ever. Uh, no, masse they means... Won't, they won't run out. No, 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 no it's, a it's an idiom. idiom. We have like time. It's an idiom. Sounds right. Not only that. Not only that. <laughs> okay, it doesn't end there. Literally, it doesn't end there. Okay, masse, and then you always pause. In in Tibetan, you always want nupa mi nupa masse. Ko ko ngala shi wu shi du zhe du masse. Ko ko pa yang yi. He's always bugging me, and he's a, he's always bugging me. And he's an idiot. Okay, Mase. Okay, Mase. There's more. <laughs> okay, so Mase. Not only will those beautiful you. objects, beautiful home, not hurt you, you will show them their nupa. Uh, I'm guessing it means. Oh. Chom. Oh, no, yeah, their power. you will yeah, smash their power. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. you smash the stranglehold of the objects of desire if you stay aware of the dangers. Okay, and use them happily. You will smash their ability to hurt you in the future. Okay, and you become immune to the dangers of the desire. Okay, objects of desire. Okay, very beautiful, very profound text. His is deeper than all of them. Okay, his is uh, uniquely. It's turning out to be tantric. I don't think it was tantric when I first looked at it. <laughs> I think something's going on. <laughs> Somebody's writing a new book. Show me your winner. Data Shepayan. Now, why does it say Data Shepayan? Oh, because they finished this. He says that's what it's talking about. But why does he say that? Because this is a root text. What the root text say? The forest of poison trees. Yeah, 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 the last line. The very last line. Go back up. Let's go back up. It was very short. Exactly. Exactly. The human computer is right. <laughs> take it take it up with joy, smash the poison. Okay? Take it up with joy. And there thereby you use the joy to smash the poison. Okay? So he says, that's what the wording means. That's, that's the last thing he... That's why he said, that's what the verse is talking about. It's actually just a line, right? Mm -hmm. All right, we're ready for another line. Seiji, Stanley has the plane. Be tough! I'm going to stop doing this system if you guys just sit there and smile <laughs> while he butchers it. <laughs> no, you don't butcher. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You're doing quite. I'm talking about other people. Hypothetical. You. Uh, Hypothetical one. case. Hypothetical case. Okay. I'll give you the first one for free. <laughs> it's not a. Tell him right now. Good. <laughs> it's not an English TZ, but sure it's not. <laughs> it's not an English TZ. <laughs> it's, <all>. <laughs> <laughs> it's not an English TZ. Tani, Tani. Tani. Good. Rang Yang. Rang Wang. Rang Wang. Mepa. Or Wa. Okay, good. That's all, and it ends with an apostrophe S. <coughs> jo yeah. Stanley's. Mm. Yeah. You know, the, where is he going? You know. Okay. Yeah. Let's wait and go back. Okay. We'll, we have the strategy with your text. We we get the commentary and then we go back to the root text. Okay. Uh, Stanley, you still have the plane. She bani te yang te 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 yang che te yen che. Yeah, Z is never Z, okay. Loton. Sin. Nyang Leng. Chi Am Leng Gi. 
It's not an English tree. Ring pa nam che par che do par che do 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 she tong chir tani nice she sung pa yin nice okay hey it's nice to teach someone who learns. Okay. Wait. Hold <laughs> on. Just kidding. <laughs> nah. Shepani. Nah. What's this line mean? Hey, Yanche. This is one we have with the the, the <coughs> nuns, the four nuns. From. Oh, from right. That, from. Uh, from that point, up, 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 four on. Or yeah. Up, up. From that on. Yeah. Yeah. So now it means the rest of the poem. Okay, from here on is the subject of the sentence. Okay, yeah. the rest of the poem is going to do something. Okay, uh, I'm sorry, here on back, okay, oh. meaning above, meaning the beginning, up to this line, up to this line, and not including this line, not including this line, up to this line, it's been a chi shape. General yeah, it's just a general introduction. Up to this line, but not including this line, it's just been a general kind of introduction. Nam song sin. Sin is a past tense. Yeah, past tense. Yeah, it went. That's how it Yeah, went. now we've finished. It has gone. It has gone, okay? We have completed song sin. We have completed uh, sort of a general explanation. And now we get to the ngushi. The main, the main section. Yeah, the main event. The main event. Yes. Exactly. The ngushi. Here comes the ngushi. Very important in terms of what? <coughs> Where does ngushi really come in? Uh, the Taking four subjects of a uh, uh, Buddhist book. book. No. Yeah. Buddhist book quality. That's yeah. Chuja. Chuja. Yeah. What four parts of the debate? No. Uh, I thought it was the vow that I'll give you the I'll, I'll give you the clue. Oh. The opposite is Nyerndong. The most famous oh, oh, Nyerndong. The platform as opposed to being in the Samten. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. When you're talking about meditation, uh, there's a uh, Mushi means the main event, okay? Yeah. And Nyerndong means the moving into the main event. The f most famous Nyerndong is yeah. Nice. Okay. Which is the required platform to see emptiness from. Okay, good. Nice. Okay. Dei en chi ki chi shen nam song sin eh. Now we get to the... Explanation. The, the main act. Okay, the main event. Which is a nyam len. Practice. How do we actually put things into practice? Okay. And now we're going to give you the rimpas of the nyam len. Steps of practice. Yeah, the steps of the actual personal practice. Okay, nyam len. Che pa che. Explain this yeah, we will be explaining mm -hmm. the steps of how to put this into actual personal practice, starting from this line. Okay? Wow. And, and to indicate that, she dun chir, to indicate that, mm -hmm. the root text says, now. Tani? Now. <laughs> okay. Uh, now. And now. <laughs> now. <laughs> okay, okay. He's, he's glossing. And now. Uh, that was all a commentary on. Now. And now. And now. <coughs> Here's the and now. Tani. Yeah. Okay, Tani. And now. It means announcing. Seiji. That's why he said Tani. And now, okay. And now, Seiji's going to read. Tang Tang. Get him. Get him. <laughs> That's how I talk to my dog too, but I'm not saying you're like a <laughs> get him. So, she comes to pick me up and the dog's like ah, ah, yeah. and then he goes <laughs> 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 I said bite her, he's like Rang Wang Me Pala Korwa Shepe Kapki Korwa Dini Cheer, tangi korwa dang, 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 korwa. You get a mantra. Dang, zin, 
Tabula. Nice, nice boo. Yeah, tabu. <laughs> no, he didn't say woo. <laughs> That's true. <he> didn't. <laughs> <laughs> tabula me. Certe. Uh, yeah. De dagni. Te dagni. Nyangrang. Soki. Ki. Soki. Kyang pang. Wa yin la. Nice. By the way, just to remind you, uh, this is from a printed book, mm -hmm. but in the same way that we're doing, this editor is careful, and he's giving you the folio number of the wood carving he worked from. That's cool. And maybe one day we can find the wood carving. Wow. Okay. So he says, I'm following a wood carving, and we just reached the front side of page 12, okay, mm -hmm. 12A. Okay. So I, I really admire it. Whoever did this editing is pretty good. We haven't found a lot of mistakes in your text. Somebody. Yeah. I thought that was the bag, no? BA? Wasn't no, it's not BA. Oh, no, you're correct. Boss back. Yeah. Boss back. Yeah. Why? Because the being, yep. Nice. Yep. It's like the only place in history, in any language, <laughs> that the. Uh, abbreviation is the last You use the last letter of the word. Gyup ends in B. The word for back ends in B. Ends in B. So it's like calling the back side CK. Right. OK? Kind of <laughs> and the front side is called NT. Dun. Yeah. Dun. N. Nah. OK? No. Yeah. Rinpoche explained that to me one day, and, and I've never heard anyone who knew that except him. So anyway, now you know. Do you think that there is, so is that parenthesis representing a Tibetan squiggle? Uh, yeah. Pro this uh, thing, yeah. this little tent, yeah. tent, um, what do you call them? Uh, Arab, Arab. Ten. Anyway, okay, yeah. Got it. Uh, when the text says "Rangwa me par korwa," uh -huh. to 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 travel in the cycle helplessly. Okay, helplessly, without any without any control. Okay, to travel in the cycle helplessly. This is gonna a super beautiful sentence. Super super beautiful. Uh, when the root text says to travel in the circle helplessly, okay, shape a cup. The cu yeah, in this in this context, mm -hmm. cup. Context. In this context, korwa, the word korwa, the cycle, the circle. Chitang mm mayin. -hmm. Is she not in a general sense? Chitong means uh, the usual sense. Okay. Oh. As we generally hear it. Okay. Okay. Chitong. And this is how, uh, in, in, a, in modern colloquial, you say generally. You don't say chitong. Doesn't Mongchewa okay. also mean generally? Yeah, Mongchewa. Uh, <coughs> most of the time it means. Oh. It means most of the time. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so chitong, kikoroa. Samsara, in the general sense of samsara, mm -hmm. is not what he's talking about. Mayin, right? Miser. That's not what he's saying here. And he's also not talking about the tsawa of korwa, which is to believe that things are coming this way. To believe that things are coming this way, okay? Dangjin. That, that's not what he's talking about. It's a very cool sentence. Mm -hmm. So what is he talking about? Yeah. Oh, and then he says, it can't be the sansara he's referring to here, because even lower or arhats have gotten rid of that. Uh, okay. What? That kind of and sansara, in the general sense. Yeah. Okay. They have escaped the wheel of life. Yeah. They, they are arhats. They, don't, they got rid of it. Therefore, it can't be what he's talking about here. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Okay. That's Very so cool. Actually, yeah. Very cool. Okay. Even our hearts, even lower our hearts, understand the pen is coming from them. Mm -hmm. Totally. Okay. Even they understand that. So that cannot be the sensory he's talking about here, mm -hmm. because we're in a lojon text. Right. So he's also okay. specifically including our hearts and I the our hearts from being able to practice this. Well, yeah. Okay. Go. Minjuk 
Min Min Minju Open Down Yeah Minju Core War Core Do Do Core Do Core Do Core Do Do Tun Juk Juk Kengi Kengi Yeah So Wo Da Chen Zin Nim Pa Pe Te La Je Gushin Go Gushin Nice Okay This is really really exquisite sentence Okay Di Kap Ki De What's the Te? Samsara. That Good. Nice, yeah. nice, nice. Yeah. The sansara, the, the that in this context, the that in this context mm -hmm. means the sansara in this context. Mm -hmm. yeah. He didn't repeat it, want to repeat the word korwa because he already said it like 20 times. <laughs> okay? The that in this context, meaning the sansara in this context, uh, is the one. Mm, I'm going to start here. Okay? Is the Juken, use it in the Vinaya sense. Juken. Oh, to get someone to do something. It's to get someone else to do her. Nice, yeah. yeah. It's the person who gets someone else to do something. Juken. Uh -huh. Got it? Yes. It's the one who makes you. Mm -hmm. The one who makes you. Ken means one. Here, it doesn't mean Kembo like Abed, forget that. It's doer, okay? Okay? It's the doer that it's the one who can to sansara. Okay? And min jukes you to sangye. Doesn't take you to Buddhahood. Yeah, it doesn't allow you to get into Buddhahood. Okay? Okay? Uh, well, who doesn't it allow to go to Buddhahood? And who does it push into sansara? <laughs> All, no, senchen tanche. Okay? And if you want to choose someone who is pushed into sansara, and not into Buddhahood by this thing that I haven't named yet, okay? You can say all living beings, mm -hmm. or you know what? You could say listeners and self-made Buddhas, okay. arhats. Mm -hmm. What keeps them out of enlightenment? Mm -hmm. Got it? Yeah. Yeah. So they are, Sunba means they are the standing in for all living beings. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? You can take them as an example that represents all living beings, okay? So what keeps lower arhats out of in full enlightenment? Same thing that keeps all beings. Yeah, good. Okay, so, so not only am I not talking about what they have defeated, which is dangzin. I'm not talking about that. That's not the sansara in this line. It's not what puts you in sansara in this line. It's not the sansara in this line. There's another energy which is keeping you out of full enlightenment, even the lower arhats, much less all beings. Okay? And what is that? Mainly self chenzin. So say dangzin. 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 What's the difference, Seiji? Self-cherishing and cherishing others? Nope. Oh, no. Stop no. cherishing and cherishing yourself. Self 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 is the belief that you have a self. In yeah. A self the belief that you come from your own side. Uh -huh. The belief in a self-existence, Seiji. The second husband. Belief in the second husband is Dang Zin. Dak Chen Zin means watch out for number one. Watch out for number one. Okay. Yeah. What's that song? If you want me to stay, I'll be around today. Number one's gonna be number one. <laughs> you played it. We did play it. Yeah, I, I, I was singing it in the house, and then I thought it was kind of wrong to sing it in front of V. Because it's like, number one's gonna be number one. And I was like, that's not a very nice thing to sing. Can you spell Dachshund? Yeah, just talk, take Doc Chins in and cut out the chain. <laughs> yeah. Okay, got it? Yeah. Different things. Dangzin, what? Yeah. Hold to a self nature of things or people. Dak Chenzin, cherish myself. Hold on to cherishing myself. Dangzin and Dang Chenzin. 
Doc Tenzin. Doc Tenzin. It's a yeah. great demonstration of that prenasal happening. It is a great prenasal. Yeah. yeah, it's a Doc great prenasal. Doc Tenzin. Okay, okay. Doc Che Gut. You got to read it this way. You got to take it this way. Che Gut. Okay. I guess it's worth noting, Geshe-la, right, that he threw a mainly in there? Yeah, so. <laughs> oh, he says it's the main instigator of uh -huh. getting you into samsara and keeping you out of enlightenment, yeah. Yeah. the main one. Uh -huh. And then, of course, it's got all anger, the, yeah. the core. Uh -huh. yeah, it's right. got its yeah. assistance, <laughs> anger, jealousy, desire, you know. But the main guy, uh -huh. the, number, the gang leader, uh -huh. yeah. is uh, <laughs> Doc Chen <Chindin. laughs> Okay. <laughs> He's not, he's not done with this little image, and it's, it's extremely beautiful. <laughs> it's going to be very nice to translate. Okay, go. Pena. Nice. Dang zin. Oh. Dang. Yeah. Dang. Yeah, here it comes. Right? Wow. Lakya. Okay. Kip bar de. De. Sam ye ba pe. Dang zin. Dang zin. Dang zin. Yeah. Heavy aspiration. Kembar. 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 You want to play with this? Wait, but do it slow and do it loud. You guys play with it. Wait, okay. Dana. Dana, on account of that. I'll give you a clue. I'll give you a clue. Kepar here doesn't mean feature. It means difference. Yeah, okay. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. One guy. Ben's going to take a shot. Okay. You crash the I mean, you take the plane. There's a difference between those two? Yeah. That therefore, there's a big ass difference mm -hmm. between these two things. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> What's the two things? Uh, when you get rid of. No, no. First, the two oh. things. Oh, oh. The two things being um, seeing things as self-existent. Yeah, and uh, cherishing yourself. Nice, seeing a self nature, and taking care of yourself. Mm -hmm. Big difference. Yeah. Kepa tetam means there's that much difference yeah. between these two. Therefore. Uh, Dangzin so Pang. When you get rid of uh, seeing things self-existent. I'm gonna give you. A, I'm gonna give you a clue. Okay. Uh -huh. He says Ma Kyam. Oh. Yeah, eliminating yeah. one does not eliminate the other. But which is which? Yeah. Eliminating. Just because. Wait, 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 of, yeah, it's just because you get rid of seeing things self-existently doesn't mean you get rid of thinking you're number one. Chichen. Mm. What's a Chichen? Uh, for example, listeners and self. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Got it. Lower our hearts. It, he's suggesting it's easier to get rid of your habit of misseeing the world than it is to get rid of your habit of taking care of yourself because there's people who get rid of their habit of misseeing the world who can't get rid of their habit of taking care of themselves and we just had two of them those lower arhats God, that's heavy it's going to get heavier it's going to get heavier this lama is off the charts I don't know why you met him uh, <laughs> Pang Bei Kyang Ma Kyo. Yeah, you can get rid of you can get rid of seeing things <coughs> self-existently, but not get rid of taking care of yourself. Okay, Ma Kyo Kyang, Dei Da Kyang Kembar Ze. This is a very very uh, he's he, what do you call it? Humoring us? What do you call it? Patronizing. Don't patronize me. Turn off the light, turn down the bed, turn off these demons in my head. Don't patronize me. He's patronizing a little bit. He says, why? He's addressing his audience. And he says, I want you to kimba. To know. Kimba nze, high on earthing. Uh -huh. uh, to know the teachings. You should understand this point. Holy ones, oh. and yeah, he uses the high honorific to the audience. Uh. Pl please, could you put this in your holy mind? You know, he's using high honorific to his audience, to his students. Uh. It, it means, please, please, please understand. Uh -huh. Okay, it's, like it's a very powerful. Yeah, it's like, please, please, please. 
understand the difference. Okay, got it? That's beautiful. Why did this all come up? Way I'm going to cry. Mm, because we circle around helplessly. Okay? But who, what's the circle? Yeah. Non enlightenment. Okay? Why? Because we got Dr. Chins in. You can escape the circle, you can escape the wheel of life and still not get to Buddhahood if you have wrong chins in. Right, so not Nirvana. Right. Okay. Nirvana's okay. Whew. Okay. Uh, how much time we got? Uh, 10 minutes. Oh, easy. Let's go, man. Tawa. 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 That, that, that tunes in Padud Ki Ponyandi. Ponya. Ponyandi. Yeah. Keep going. Shepandi Ni Dat Chen Zin La Jeba Yin Te. Dat Chen Zin Te Ni Ni Dud Yin La De Po Te Po Nye Ponya. Ponya. Nice. This is also unbelievable. It's so sexy. Uh, uh, Dr. Zimba. Uh, holding, believing that things are themselves, I like to translate it now this, okay? Mm -hmm. Believing that things are themselves is the ponya. Oh, messenger. Yeah, and it's an important word in Tantra. 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 Ponya means your spiritual partner. And, oh. and the one you work with on your channels. Cool. Channel, the one you do channel practice with is called a messenger, okay? Oh, okay? Uh, but here it means d Amen. <coughs> Yeah, the messenger of the demons. The emissary of the demons, okay? What do you call that when the emperor, the Chinese emperor used to send emissary? Mm -hmm. They send their representative to other kingdoms. Ambassador. That's called a ponya also. So uh, the representative of the emperor was called ponya, okay? Here it's kind of a representative, okay? The, the one you send to foreign countries to tell them about your country and you know you'd like to do trade with them or something like that okay very common in Tang Chao I, I was reading about it it was very interesting this is some guy he went 13 years he was captured the emperor sent him out and said go make a relationships with this country and he got caught in between 13 years, uh, a slave escaped, came back. The emperor said, you're so good at this, let's do it again. <laughs> <laughs> and he sent, he sent him to south, south of China. Whoa. And he got caught again oh, and gosh. made a slave. And uh, he escaped again. The first time he was made a slave, he came back with the banner. A hundred men were sent, mm -hmm. only one oh. returned. And he brought back the, the emperor's flag with him, you know, very famous. Uh, not in the Tang Chai thing. I, I'll, I'll show it to you. I was thinking it would be a cool name to use for a band or something. Like <laughs> no, because he went a second time, he got caught again, he came back again, and I think he went a third time. Uh, but he was, a, he was a slave for like 13 years or something. And, but he kept the banner secretly, and he came home with it. You don't want to know where. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, uh, Shade Benini, uh, this is all talking about Doc Chenzin. Doc Chenzin, okay, Chepa. This is all talking about Doc Chenzin. Okay, it says Dang Zin, holding to itself. But it's all about Dang Zin, Dang Chenzin. Why? Doc Chenzin Deni is the do. The demon. The real demon is cherishing yourself. The, the real demon is cherishing yourself. And his representative that he sends in front of him is Dangjin. Wow. Okay. 
be the big man behind Dong Zin is Dong Chen Zin. Usually we do it yeah, this way, right? Yeah. It's a very powerful awesome. statement, awesome. right? But that's pretty common in low jumps. Too. Yeah, low jumps gonna say that, but I think it's awesome. Yes. Uh, so the tendency to miss see things is just the representative of the big guy in the back, which is taking care of yourself. Very interesting. Zim Yinbe, Deni Bunyo. You should understand the relationship between the two. Who's the boss and who's the worker? Bunyo yeah. uh -huh. means master and slave. Right. Yeah. Who's the boss? Who is the boss? The uh, yeah, taking care of myself. Dak mm -hmm. Tianzin. And who's the slave? Dark Misunderstanding. Yeah, Dang Zin works for Dang Tianzin. That's, that's amazing. That's really cool. Yeah, that's like. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hot. Going, Wait a minute, when yeah, I know. That's your that's a different text today. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, go. Sawa. Rang de de ro dang par par pal chal par chal chala chala chete Chitting dra, then draw away, then draw away. Dang dang zing, hong yong ni, charang de, kiro dang kin de, kiro sok dang, sok dang park prau, chel na, ne, ten yi kin de pe. One, two, meet, don't wow. Okay. Uh, now he's talking about both of them together. The pun and the yoke. Uh, the boss, and slave. master and slave. Uh, both of them, okay. Din Dao and Dang Zin. And he, he kind of did a cute thing. What did he do? Here. He, said, he, he refers to both of them as oh, Dang Zin. Right. He shortens Dark Chin Zin to Dang Zin, and he calls them these two kinds of Dang Zin, which is Dang Zin and Dang Chin Zin. Right. Okay, got it? Mm -hmm. yes. He calls them both Dang Zin, but they're not. Okay, these two kinds of Dang Zin. Okay. Ni Cha, Rang Duki Ro, Dang Kin Duki Ro, So Partel. Send. I, I don't know. Ro can mean dead body, but uh, it can also mean rasa, rasa, this kind of flavor. And I think it is the flavor. Uh, that's why it'd be nice to have the Sanskrit, because it'll be different. Uh, anyway, rang uh, duki ro means what you want, and kin duki ro means you want to be happy. Okay separate them from these two guys. Okay? Take take the taste off of them. Okay? You need to separate them and send them away. Okay? Dipe wang du mi tong wang. Dipe means don't let yourself come under their thrall. Okay? What they want. Yeah. Unusual word in, in English. Doesn't pass the waiter test. No. But it's a beautiful word, thrall. In it means It means like a magic uh, person can do this and then suddenly you're like, Yes, master and you say, Go to my car, get my coat, come back. You can make somebody do anything. It's called thrall. It was an old uh, like Norwegian word or something. <laughs> It means you use T-H-R-A-L-L, -L. and it means uh, they do some voodoo on you, they go like and then they say, okay, take your clothes off, and you're like, yes, sir, you know, and, and you know, it's like hypnosis, yeah, yeah. It's old English, it's Norse. Old Norse? It is Norse. Oh, Norse, not Norwegian, yeah. Anyway, uh, what it means is, "depe wang du mi tang" means don't let your don't send yourself under the power of what they want. You know, don't sell yourself to them. Okay. Okay. Rang de kin de rodam partela. Separate yourself 
from the taste, although I'm not comfortable completely. I, I wish we had another commentary. It might be nice to find another commentary. Uh, the taste, the rasa of uh, wanting what you want for yourself and what would make you happy. Okay? Rang de means what you want as opposed to what the other person wants. In any given situation, try to keep away these thoughts of what you want and what would make you happy. Rang de, kin de. Ki means happy, right? It's a common woman's name, deki. Uh, we have a deki larso. Lars, deki larso is one of our input centers. And, uh, larso, by the way, means uh, resettlement. Lar, again, so, you know, refugee. Okay? Yeah, time's up. Yeah. Where? Do we have this text in the database? Okay, uh, I would try in the meantime work with uh, Nick or somebody or, or Ben or Word and see if you can find another commentary to this text. Maybe there is one. Did it, was there a commentary in the? There's a there's a very 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 valuable book of Lojongs that Chijong Rinpoche put together. It was one of the first books in Tibetan printed on hard cold type metal type. And he spent years on it, yeah. and it's this thick, and it's all the lojongs you can imagine. And there's a lot of lojong commentaries in there, so mm -hmm. you might look in there. Is that where we got the little ones that we used to? That's where we got all of them. Yeah, they're all from there. Cool. And he worked and worked and worked and worked, and he he collected. He was a great book collector. Cool. Oh, he, right. And he collected, 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 collected. And then he made a. It was a stunning piece of work, <laughs> you know. So anyway, he was that kind of person. Uh, yeah, those little ones. Oops. Excuse me. Thanks, Gisha. Welcome. Sashi Bugi Jushin Metok Chan Vira Ling Shin Yin De Yen Badi Sang Ye Shing Du Ming Te Shimma Chupar Show, 